This will be a five minute student orientation to the Echo 360 Active Learning Classroom. Most students want to actively participate in their own learning, but sometimes it's hard to do this in a 200 seat lecture theatre. The Active Learning Classroom allows students to take notes next to the lecture slides, to ask questions on a lecture slide, to flag a slide as confusing or important so they can review it, to answer questions that the lecturer displays on the screen, and to review lecture slides and to expand their notes after the class. To start to use your ECHO 360 Active Learning Classroom, go to your unit or course site, click on the link to enter the ECHO 360 Active Learning Classroom. Here we are, looking at a student login, looking at a Moodle site. I can click Enter the Active Learning Classroom, and you'll see this will bring me to the home page for that particular unit. I can click on that class and then click go to classroom. And now I'll see the slides that the lecturer has prepared. You'll see the slide looks exactly the same as the lecturer displays. But if I mouse over it, we'll see certain buttons come up. At the bottom, there are buttons to allow you to go to the previous and next slide or to look at the thumbnails of all of the slides in the presentation. At the left, you'll see a number of buttons that allow you to open a notes field, ask questions, flag something as important, or to flag something as confusing. So this button allows us to take notes. I can click on the button. We'll see a notes field opens on the right. These notes are automatically saved into the cloud on the ECHO 360 Active Learning platform, and you'll have access to those notes for as long as you have access to the course material. After the class, you can modify those notes if you want to expand them. Another feature is you can bookmark a slide as important. So now I bookmark slide number seven as important. Perhaps the lecturer said that this will be on the exam, so I need to remember to review that particular note. Now we're looking at the lecturer view of this particular slide, and you'll see that no students have said, said that it's confusing. If we go to the student view and then click the confused flag, you'll see immediately it shows that one person is confused on the lecturer's view. And the lecturer might use that to review that particular slide or go over it. The ECHO 360 Active Learning Classroom also allows the students to ask questions. If I click this icon, I can ask a question. I could reference it to a particular slide, or I could post it anonymously if I wanted to. So the lecturer has given an answer, and they can post it. The lecturer might even decide that they want to endorse the question and the answer. Another thing the lecturer can do in the Active Learning Platform is prepare interactive slides, which the students can answer during the presentation. Here we've got a question, what is 2 plus 2? And you'll see that no students have answered it. We'll go back to the student view, click an answer and click submit. Now back in the lecturer view, you can see that one person has answered this particular question. The lecturer can stop the poll, show the results, and even show which is the correct answer. If we go back to the student view, the student will see that one person has answered that, and that was the correct answer. These questions can be much more complicated. What will make it easier for you in a large class? Hold down the control key to select multiple options. You also need to provide a justification or add other issues. Well, I think it would be good if I could write notes alongside the slides. It would be good if I could get the lecturer to spend more time on a confusing slide. So I'm going to click all of those options and click Submit. Again, the lecturer might decide to show that and use that in the uh, presentation. Here's another example of a question. Where is the patella bone in the human skeleton? If you're unsure, ask your neighbour or guess. Also type the common name or the name in another language. 
I think this is where the patella is. The lecturer could be looking at this particular slide, close it and show the results. And we'll see that one person has said it was here. If it was a larger class, you'd see dots all over the image. And they can also show the correct area, which is here shown in this yellow square. It's your education. We want you to actively participate, make it worthwhile. You can use the Echo 360 Active Learning to take notes in your own words, ask and answer questions during and after the presentation, and review the slides and review your notes.